A big boost today for Intel to the tune of $5 billion. Tech giant NVIDIA announced that investment into the chipmaker, giving its rival company essentially a lifeline. It's truly an historic collaboration and our top story right now at 430. Thanks for staying with us. I'm Angela Ann. And I'm Stacia Nuckin. Local experts say this investment could benefit the Intel project under construction right now in Licking County. Here's what Ohio's governor said this morning, just hours before this news broke. Look, I mean, you know, all I know is that, you know, Intel is building a facility in Ohio. They've already put about $8 billion into the ground. Uh, they're not they're not moving. Ships are going to get made there when they're going to get made. I can't tell you and, and what kind of chips, but chips are going to get made there. So, you know, all the back and forth in regard to uh, where Intel is, that's not something that I frankly can control. But I have every confidence that chips are going to be made uh, right here in central Ohio. That was the governor's comment just after the announcement. It's a sentiment we're hearing from other leaders in central Ohio saying they are even more confident now in what's being built in Licking County. But nothing is set in stone on whether NVIDIA will manufacture Intel's fabs. The two companies wrapped up a news conference just a few hours ago. When asked about the future of chip making in the U.S., the Intel CEO said it's important, but they have to think about profits and what they've developed globally. Meanwhile, we also have the footprint uh, from Intel uh, globally. And so in the way we just meet customer requirement, include the NVIDIA, and then so that they have the flexibility uh, which uh, best suitable for them. And then uh, meanwhile, we continue to improve our year of performance. So you might remember that the White House just weeks ago pledged to invest nearly nine billion federal dollars into Intel, creating a 10 percent government stake in the company. I reached out today to several local leaders, and they're all pretty much saying the same thing, that this sends a clear signal that America needs Intel. Columbus Partnership CEO Jason Hall added this, saying this partnership reflects the scale of innovation underway and reinforces why American manufacturing matters. What we're building in the Columbus region, he says, is essential to meeting global demand and securing long-term U.S. leadership in advanced technology.